Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. Following in the footsteps of the United States, the Netherlands has joined the ranks of restrictions on lithography machines, expanding from the original restriction on EUV lithography machines to high-end process equipment in DUV lithography machines. This adds more variables to the operation of ASML in the Chinese market, or faces more challenges. Before the ban on lithography machines came into effect, the Chinese special plane landed in the Netherlands, and domestic high-level officials held talks with Dutch high-level officials. China has given the steps, and the Netherlands has to seize them. The Netherlands holds the world's leading lithography machine manufacturing strength and occupies an important position in the semiconductor manufacturing industry. It just so happens that China has accelerated the development of the chip manufacturing industry, invested more production force, and has more demand for the purchase of lithography machines. However, Due to the interference of the United States, it has become more difficult for China to obtain Dutch lithography machines. Especially when it comes to high-end EUV lithography machines, the Dutch company ASML has not been able to ship freely so far. Chinese companies submitted orders as early as 2018. Now not only has there been no news of the delivery of the order, but also the Netherlands has cooperated with the United States to expand the scope of restrictions on lithography machines and include high-end process equipment in DUV lithography machines for export. Control According to news from the Netherlands, the ban will be implemented this summer. Although it was under the pressure of the United States, the choice was made by the Netherlands itself. Once there are unexpected consequences, the Netherlands has to bear it. However, before the lithography machine ban takes effect, there may be room for recovery, because the Chinese special plane landed in the Netherlands, and the high-level Chinese and Dutch high-level talks may turn things around. According to news reports, high-level Chinese leaders held a three-day meeting at the invitation of the Netherlands. China mentioned the need to work together to meet challenges and jointly ensure the stability of the global supply chain. The Netherlands also stated that China is an important trading partner of the Netherlands. During the visit to the Netherlands, Chinese high-level officials also met with the person in charge of ASML. With the end of China's visit to the Netherlands, it is believed that a series of impacts will begin to appear, including, but not limited, to the further deepening of the cooperative relationship between China and the Netherlands, changing the attitude of the Netherlands to join the US restricted team and increasing ASML's confidence in investing in the Chinese market etc. Of course, these are just predictions, and further observation is needed to see whether they will develop in these directions in the future. But what is certain is that the Netherlands still does not want to lose China, an important trading partner. China is the world's largest semiconductor market. The lithography machines produced in the Netherlands need to be exported to China. Even if an agreement is reached with the United States, the Netherlands does not want to make trouble the point of no return. Moreover, the Netherlands has been actively expressing its stance on the Chinese market. After reaching an agreement with the United States, Dutch officials emphasized that there are still many old equipment that can be shipped. ASML also said that demand from other customers has declined and more lithography machines can be shipped to China in the second half of this year. In fact, 
it is not difficult to understand the Dutch approach. The business is their own, and the money they earn will go to their own pockets. The United States frequently interferes with the Dutch business, which is harmful to the Dutch. In addition to making the United States less troublesome, all consequences must be borne by itself. Now China is willing to do business with the Netherlands and has not changed its cooperation attitude because of the agreement with the United States. This is what the Netherlands hopes to see, at least paving the way for continuing to open the door to the Chinese market. However, it is not so easy for the Netherlands to make money so easily. While restricting China with the United States, while making money in the Chinese market, you can't have both fish and bear's paws, so China has given a step. There is still room to turn around and make adjustments in time to avoid going to the last step. If the Netherlands is determined not to look back, then China may not have a solution, which is to accelerate the independent research and development of domestic lithography machines. In the case of no choice, China will replace imported lithography machines with its own lithography machines to meet the chip production needs of domestic semiconductors. The Netherlands' participation in the United States' restrictions on lithography machine technology will bring certain challenges and pressures to China's semiconductor industry. China's independent research and development and innovation capabilities in the field of lithography machines still need to be further improved to meet this challenge. In order to accelerate the self-development of lithography machines, China can make efforts in many aspects. The first is to strengthen scientific and technological innovation. China needs to strengthen research on the core technology of lithography machines and improve its independent innovation capabilities. At the same time, it is necessary to strengthen the protection of intellectual property rights and protect the results of independent research and development. Secondly, cultivate high-level talents with lithographer-related technology research and development capabilities to enhance the core competitiveness of the semiconductor industry. In addition, strengthen cooperation with domestic and foreign lithography machine industry chain-related enterprises and jointly promote the independent research and development promotion and application of lithography machine technology. Lithography machine technology is one of the key technologies in the semiconductor industry. China needs to strengthen its independent research and development of lithography machines to improve its technical level and market competitiveness. In the case that imported lithography machines are not available, Self-research is the best way out. Although the road ahead is long, as long as it succeeds, everything is worth it. If you agree with the point of view of this video, please like it, welcome to forward, leave a message and share.